What is going on everybody, Matic222, back at you guys with another figure review. Today we are looking at the Elite Brother Love Legend series from Mattel, from good, good old uh, Mattel. This figure is of course a Target exclusive, uh, we don't have Target here so I did purchase it online. Uh, yeah, so we're going to take the figure out of the box and look at him. That's the format that we do, looking at the box really quick. You can see the nice picture rendering of Brother Love on the side. Very creepy. Don't like that. And the same picture on the back with a little bio right there. Of course, you can pause the video and read that if you'd like. Same thing on the side. There you go, Legends, Brother Love. And uh, nothing really on the bottom or the top. So we're going to get him out of the box and let's take a closer look. All right, now looking at the figure out of the box, the first thing I noticed... Uh, the face is way, way too red, and I do understand what they were going for. Uh, he always had a comically bright red face. I think they overdid it a little bit too, a little bit too much here. I understand what they were going for, uh, but it just almost looks comically, comically red. Another, uh, another problem: the glasses. M Mattel has to kind of. Uh, figure out what they want to do with these glasses because this is no good the, the problem is that uh they they just sit on his face like that they don't attach in any kind of way so uh, if he does a shelf dive or you know if you drop him or anything prepare for these glasses to just permanently be gone they need to kind of they need to kind of figure out what they want to do with the glasses perhaps uh perhaps an alternate head would do the trick but uh yeah this is just a no-go in my book glasses are the glasses are nice like they're kind of they look nice but yeah they're just way too easy to lose as far as the sculpting it is a plain suited body can't really expect all that much out of it and it is a white body a blank white body so paint apps fair, fairly lacking not really any paint apps but they did manage to what little paint apps paint apps they have they did manage to still fuck it up uh because you can see they only painted around the neckline they only painted that red and you could clearly see his white shirt you can see where they just stopped painting. And I think that looks lazy. I think that looks lazy and like they just did a rush job. And this was before my time. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that, but I, I don't think it is. I think he wore a red shirt underneath. I, I wish they would just would have went all the way and painted the torso red or sculpted the torso red and did a better job of painting it. Because, yeah, you can see right there that it, it's just his neckline that's painted. And they didn't even do, they didn't even paint the whole thing. Looks lazy, sloppy. Uh, so that in combination with the overly red face. They didn't have a lot of paint apps to do on this figure. But what paint apps they did, I think they totally messed it up. Sculpting on the face is nice. It does look like Brother Love. I'll give it that, and the hair is sculpted nicely. He's got the white tie, so it is sculpted nice. Yeah, and then on his hands, they gave him some nicely sculpted rings. And they put a little paint on there, so at least they did do that. That at least looks okay. As far as articulation, it's a Mattel suited body, so you know you don't expect much. You do get a side to side on the head and you know forward and back arms move up to about there that's about the most you're gonna get and then he has a bicep swivel which does what it's supposed to you can move it in any direction and the double jointed elbow which again pretty good range of motion on that so I can't be too mad at that at all wrist hinge is nice as far as the ab articulation he does have a waist twist uh, the ab you can't crunch it as much because 
this jacket is basically just a rubber overlay and uh, any articulation he would have had in the torso is just completely undone by this rubber overlay but you can still have him bending over uh, but that's just because the the thigh part here again he has almost basic style legs basic style legs and I say that because uh, the hips do not move at all but he does have a thigh swivel and he does have a double jointed knee so I guess there's that and as far as the feet go he has ankle rockers and hinges and the shoes are nice I like the shade of brown they used on the bottom pretty good I think I said uh, thigh earlier but I meant to say uh, this crotch piece so he can just move because he has that, that basic style crotch piece where it's only cut joints they don't really move out again they even if they would have moved out this rubber overlay jacket completely would have stopped that from happening accessories he does come with two alternate hands which I don't know what these are supposed to be like I, I don't know what those hands are supposed to be you 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 tell me you tell me what those hands are I don't know they they're not not a open hands or anything I don't know and then he does he does default in the package with the two holding hands so you can hold this which I guess is a uh, supposed to be a microphone which again probably is accurate to what he used on the show but again you 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 tell me what you think this is uh, what you think this looks like again the, you can see it is a microphone because you can see that part there but it uh, doesn't look great but I guess it probably is show accurate so I can't be too mad at that looks kind of like a flashlight to me I think it looks like a flashlight and uh, he also comes with this book this red book it says the book of love it's just plastic it doesn't open doesn't do anything other than be a book for him to hold but it, it does look nice nonetheless and uh, see if he can hold it in one hand I bet he can I bet he can hold it all right let's see there we go see there we go he's got the book and he has enough he has enough articulation that he can hold it like that and he's got his microphone that looks all right right it, it, it's it's fine for what it is can't be mad at the articulation like it is brother love he is just a suited character so i can't be too mad at the articulation and the accessories are nice so all in all i do like this figure i do like this figure in in for what it is but uh i i really really wish they had did a better job on the paint apps like i said the shirt to me is just too lazy and almost inexcusable how bad that looks and the face they might have hit it with too much red overlay but all in all it's a nice brother love he probably won't get another figure because i think this is it so you know if you want him you want a brother love you want to have him managing your undertaker this is probably the one to get i don't know i don't think he gets another figure but who knows we'll see but i think that is going to be it my friends that is it for this review i hope you enjoyed it if you did of course please like share comment subscribe let me know what you think of this figure and uh, if you didn't like the video of course feel free to give it a thumbs down no problem with that uh yeah so again we're back trying to uh do some reviews again and hopefully you guys are digging them thank you as always for your continued support i do so much so much appreciate that as always i have been mad at 222 you have been awesome and I will see you hopefully in the next video. Have a great morning, afternoon, or evening, and bye.